transforming the S-Class into a mild hybrid, it cannot run on electric power alone, is the addition of a roughly 65-pound, shoebox size, 0.9 kWh lithium-ion battery pack under the hood and a 50-pound electric motor sandwiched between the engine and a 7-speed automatic. Despite the additional weight of the hybrid gear, however, the S400, at 4,594 pounds, is the lightest 9th generation S-Class we've tested. The hybrid doesn't have the deep power reserve of the effortless S550, you know, for when someone really needs to be shown who's boss, and the V6 can occasionally sound strained, but it isn't exactly slow, either. Getting to 60 miles per hour requires 7.1 seconds versus 5.3 for the last S550 we tested, and the quarter mile, at 15.4 seconds, is slower by 1.5. The electric motor seamlessly fills in low-end torque, of which there's still plenty for brake torque burnouts. Mercedes says drivers won't be able to feel whether braking is regenerative, using the electric motor, or conventional, using the friction brakes. That's true, but only because the brake pedal is so numb that pretty much nothing can be felt, which is the S400's only off-putting flaw. While slowing to a stop, the engine switches off, the electric motor restarts it as soon as the brake pedal is released which is actually smoother and quicker than a typical, non-hybrid start sequence.